gate opening. Who's coming out? Oh, just a person. People. Three people. Hello. Have you released? Yes. Oh, well done. How long have you been there for? 20 days. 20 days? We have some emergency here. Gentlemen uh, emergency? He's doing the videography, photography on site. And... Welcome back to another video, guys. We're at the Heathrow Immigration Detention Centre. Here. At Heathrow. It's quite busy this morning. Seen quite a few vans preparing for something. Here they all are, look. Uh, got the old high vis on today. See how that goes. <coughs> You've got the vans here with the, uh, the little windows in for the prisoners. Longer, longer vans, more cells. We are recruiting custody officers in your area. Well, there you go, guys. If you want a if you want a job working for immigration custody, go there. <coughs> We're going to do a little story today on this place. Little audit as well. See how the place is doing. And there we go. I think it's quite well suited for the old uh, hotel topic at the moment. Uh, it's about to rain here as well. It's about to pour down. I think it's not good. But yeah, lots of vans here. So, we'll see what's going on. Busy, busy today. Hmm, <laughs> anyway. <coughs> Still got a little bit of a cough, unfortunately. Let's zoom into these boys, see what they're doing. There we go. There we go. He ain't happy, is he? He ain't happy at all. But we're not getting kicked off here. We're going to do a little story first. <coughs> see what's going on. You've got the prisoner fence down there. As you can see. We're going to zoom into that. Have a little look. Colnebrook. Colnebrook Immigration Detention Centre. This way. So you've got numerous gates there for the vans to drive in to unload and load their prisoners. Some for deportation, some maybe not. <coughs> oh, what happened to that van? Got some damage on the side there, isn't it? What are you guys all waiting for? What's that? Are we picking up? What happened to your van? Is that you? Someone else? Say again, mate, can't hear you. These things are always showing up in the dead Are they? Yeah, we share, we share them, so... People okay. They'll just park it and not eat it. Looks quite bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so all you guys waiting to pick up and go out, are you? Oh. So if you're picking up, would that mean you're picking people up that are going to the airport to be deported or possibly elsewhere? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the possibilities are that you could be taking someone somewhere else to be detained. Uh, yeah. Other place, other locations. Yeah, yeah, could be. Transfer, that's it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm air so. Oh, okay. Yeah, cool, man. Yeah. Thanks for that, mate. <coughs> Very informative. Heathrow vehicle base. Stick to the footpath, shall we? We don't want to break too many rules.
Oh, we've got the gate opening. What we got coming out of here then? Another van maybe with a prisoner in? Detainee. Let's have a look, shall we? BG70 CNA. Seems friendly enough. Hello. Uh, maybe. Is it busy? Sorry, I, I request that you do not film here. This okay. is private property. Yeah. So if you don't mind, I it's taxpayers to... paid for it, so it's kind of accessible. It's not as long it's as I'm along it's here. Property, and you're not meant to be here for me, I'm afraid. Okay. All right, uh, what so it is, I've, I've came to do a story today on obviously your centre. Okay. Well, That's what it is. I um, can refer you to the press department if you'd like to talk to anyone. Yeah, if they're here. Um, no, they're not here. Oh. But if you get get in touch, if you ring yeah. up. Our head office i'm sure that they'll be more than happy to what it is i do you. videos on hotels you know the asylum seeker hotels so I'm i thought really, this may be i'm only here to speak about the yeah fact that i'm not asking I'm you any questions you to please vacate just me. informing you what i'm doing okay and i that's fine you're entitled to that and all the rest of it but i'm just asking you as a courtesy if you would mind yeah. just leaving the grounds please what it is with all due respect i appreciate you've requested that uh, I've came here to do, a, I've travelled quite far to do a video today here. So I'm going to do my best to get that video done. Talk to a few people, show the building and stuff. Um, I'm going to respect what you've said, I'm not going to come inside. I'm not going to like climb any fences. No, well, nothing like that. No. <laughs> <laughs> this is a secure site. Yeah, so, it, it yeah. much would be on any other secure site. So yeah, 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 that's fine. Allow anyone to just walk around and do as and what they please, walking in and out of the, the centres, for instance. Okay, I didn't know you could. I mean, well, you can't. right, uh, okay. So, it's like a prison, uh, right? Pretty much. Uh, look, I'm, I'll refer you to the press. Okay? No, I mean, in terms it's of your security, you. it's like a prison, isn't it? So it's. If you want to think that, that's. You can't just walk in, I mean, kind of thing. You can't. Well, yes, we have. they have their visitors, yeah. Okay, you can, got you. Yeah. Yeah, you have to book that, presumably, so I can't just I walk really in. I can't tell you because, yeah. you know, that, again, I'll refer you. My point is, I've got to stay outside, like a prison. Well, yes, yeah, yeah. It's private land, so I'm, yeah. I'm asking you to please not film. Okay. Um, to just, you know. Are there anybody, any other staff around I could just talk to? No. Oh, okay. No, staff will refer you, as I have, to the press. Okay, I spoke to one already. It, just explaining, like, they're coming in to pick people up. Sometimes you do transfers. That's okay. it, just basic questions, nothing well, to... Um... They, sh they, they really shouldn't be talking. Because, oh, right. Because, um, you know, I, I mean, it's pretty obvious anyway. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it is. It's, um, it's not, not everybody not, knows. Not, if you really want answers to your questions, the best yeah. place to go is, like I say, to go to the press. But the thing is, I want the answers on video. Do you appreciate that? Well, so the viewers can be you're, informed. You're, I'm afraid that's not going to happen. Okay. Um, you're a manager, aren't you? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, so is that your staff car park? Yeah. Presumably no. there's a barrier, so that's staff. It's oh, it's not? But Public. At the end of the day, again, this, I'm not, I'm not going to answer any more questions. I'm just going to let you please. Do not film. The reason I'm asking you these questions is so that I know where I can and can't go. Well, this is all Crown property. So I understand that, but I'm going to be on site where I can legally be to film. I'm not going to go around there. Clearly, you can't. can't I'm not going to go in there. I'm not going to go through your gate. But that car park is open, so I'm just checking if it's, if it's your staff car park, I'll stay away. If it's public... Well, it, it is some of, the, some of the staff that are... Okay, fair enough. So. Vehicle base, so that's staff as well staff okay so i'll just stay out here then pretty much and just film from out here please do not film i'm asked you not to yeah i'm requesting you not to i appreciate you doing your job but i have came to do a video today okay well i, I can't just not do it you, you, you do not and, okay you know so security have as well been informed have they yes oh okay are they going to come and talk to me or i don't know they've just been informed they might they might not you know but i'm, I'm okay I'm fair enough asked you and yeah yeah I'm sure you get a lot of I'm people not, filming not, here, don't you? I'm not here to, to enforce in any way. I'm just saying, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure you get a lot of people filming this side, don't you? It's quite a busy area and stuff as well. So I, I think a few people have been here to film before, I guess. I, I, yeah. Just... Anyway, I'm going to go in because Yeah, yeah. Take care. Well. All right. Take care. Bye bye. <laughs> well, guys, there we go. Main gate there. 
got a lorry unloading here. Not sure what they're unloading. Just as we arrive, it's starting to rain. Oh, he's been given the go-ahead. In he goes. Hello. You all right, mate? All right. What they got in there? Food. Food. <laughs> Crisps, walkers. Yeah, yeah, water. Oh, water, yeah. Nice, cool. I think the lorry's blocked the van in there. <coughs> Sorry? Didn't I just speak to you? I spoke to you just, didn't I? Same lady, yeah? I, I understand that, I respect that. I'm gonna stand up here and film. I can't just not film. she's telling the driver not to talk to me. Recognise you? From somewhere. Main gate closing, guys. <laughs> Can I just ask her who you are and what you're doing here? Can I ask what I'm doing here? I don't feel I need to give you a name, I mean. No, you don't have to give me a name at all. Uh, no, just so that I'm making a video, I do hotel videos, hotels that house asylum seekers okay. for my channel. And obviously this place is kind of related. Right. So I've just came to do a story on it today and find out as much as I can about the place. And uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, that's it. Nothing too exciting, you know? <laughs> so, who are you? Are you an officer? Yes. Okay, cool. Nice. Don't be concerned. Just going to be filming. That's it. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. So far, so good. Well, kind of. Apart from the damn rain. So it's a bad time to be doing this filming. So the food being unloaded for the prisoners there. Busy, busy today here, very busy. Got the spikes in the road there. Busy, isn't it, today? Huh? Busy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or is it always busy? <laughs> the rainbow over there, guys. Well, we're going to see what happens. Body camera rolling. Electric charging points over there for the cars. Do you guys deliver to all different prisons, do you? No, 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 no. I just need to see you. Nice. Oh, 
parcel network. Yeah, so this place holds people who are detained for their immigration status to either be deported or elsewhere transferred to another detaining place <coughs> but it's typical prison built here typical bars typical layout oh got some milk dropping off there drop the milk buddy Oh, is it water? Yeah, yeah. Ah. Well, there's a stuff conversing with each other. That looks very precariously balanced from there. <laughs> well, no one else has bothered us apart from that one. More vans waiting to go in. Long old process getting into these places and getting out. Very tedious job. Heathrow vehicle base. <coughs> it's quite pretty, isn't it? The painting on the wall there. Flowers, benches. Care and custody. Visitors in there, staff in there. Staff door is open. Holmbrook Immigration Removal Centre reviewed March 2009 long time ago that <coughs> Immigration and Asylum Act 1999 same rules as a prison pretty much We have a little walk down the road where the bars are, fence and stuff. <coughs> this cough is killing me. It's improving though. Thank God. Let's have a little walk down here. It looks to me like this place on the left is also prison. <coughs> Not sure what it is, probably one place, I guess. Yeah, not, not a nice place to be. So 
So we've walked all the way down to the end of this road. I'm going to figure out what's down at this end. Looks like they've got Heathrow Police Base next door. BT Communications. So this is a through road. Because here is a different business, apparently. Interesting. There is the police base. Heathrow Police Base, I believe. Well, the back of it anyway. I'll have a quick look over here. No, it's not a police base. Rivas Vehicle Service Centre. <coughs> okay, look at all those cars. BMW there, it's uh, pretty pretty badly smashed up pretty badly smashed up yeah ironic they've got the uh, vehicle service for the police down uh, down a road from a prison. Interesting. Look at that uh, security top of that fence. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure the prison is both sides of the uh, road. <coughs> if we look at that. Pretty sure this side over here is definitely a prison of kind. Let's go and have a look at that one then. Not as many cameras on this side though. Well, no, there's not. Now that camera up there is following me. So this place on the right hand side are following me on the cameras. Let's see if the left hand side is following me. Doesn't seem to be. So let's go and check out the place on the right hand side. Well here we go. Right hand side building. Let's go take a look. Find out if it's part of it or what it is. The bars on the windows are not proper prison bars. Home office. It's the same thing though. Drug detection dog, dogs in operation main entrance the radio stand here on the uh, right down below look and another big gate to get in Immigration Removal, the removal Centre, Harmonsworth. So there's another Immigration Removal Centre here. <coughs> Two of them next door to each other.
Hmm. Okay. Let's wait and see what happens. Visitor center. Here. Hello. Nice. What's the difference between the two buildings, my friend? Why? You have a cam. Yeah, I'm doing it well. I was doing a video outside. No, no, which, which com company are you from? No, I do videos. I'm not, not from a company. Um, who are you then? Can I see your ID? I'm just asking you which... No, I, 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 you are in a place. It's an old place. You come and doing your video and photography without permission. Yeah, outside, not in here. Huh? Because I think in here is not allowed. This includes. Yeah. Oh no, sorry. I thought it was saying no photography. No, no. Where are you from? Which I'm just an individual doing a doing individual. a story today on the on the prison. Yeah. Mm. But what it is, I was over that side, there, and um, I've noticed here's a prison as well. So. No, no. Is Can it I two prisons? ID? Any any form of ID, driving license, or passport? Where's your ID? No, no. I need to find her. You're on our premises. Yes. I'd like to know who you are. Why do you need to know who I am? No, I, I, because it, it's my right to ask you. You can ask? Yeah, I can ask you. It's my right to decline you, my friend. You, you can decline. Yeah. Uh, I need to All it is, I've just seen you open here. So I just wanted to know whether it's two different prisons or it's the same prison. That's it. Yeah. If you can't, if you can't answer, I'm going to carry on going outside and film, all right? No, you, can, you can't carry on. I can, I'm going to carry on. No, you can't do that. I will. I'll, I'll wait a second. I'm going to go outside. Yeah, yeah we have some emergency here. Gentlemen uh, emergency. He's doing the videography, photography on site, and he's asking all the information. And uh, he's not giving his ID. I'm not giving any information. As I'm talking, he's recording me as well. Just recording your ID, so I know who you are. Yeah. All right. I'm going to go outside. Yeah. Why did you say an emergency? Do these things, yeah, which are not it's not an emergency, though, is it? No, it's an emergency. Um, Why is it an emergency? Emergency means this is the home office side, government side. Yeah, I understand uh, that. And I uh, understand that. You I'm, understand? I'm doing a story still, on it. Uh? I'm doing a story on it today. What? What? A story. I'm doing a story. A journalist of story. You are a journalist. Story. Independent. Yes. Uh, so what I'm doing? I'm doing a story on the prison, and I wanted to find out whether. This prison is the same prison as that one, or it's the same place, that's it. Huh? Is it the same place? That's all I want to know. No, but... That's it. Why, why should we give you this information? You will find out on the... Because if I find it quicker, then I'll leave quicker, won't I? No, you can't is she coming in that. here? No. Here, do you want to hold the door? Um, yeah, so I've, been, I've already been over there. I'm finished over there. I came this side, and I've noticed you've got another prison. But there's a road in between. Sir, what's your name? Why do you need my name? What will that give you, my name? Tell me. No, please, sir. It's a, see, you, you, are, you are a responsible citizen of this country. Oh, what? Sorry? Are you a responsible citizen of this country? Yes. Yes, you are. Then you, be, you act responsibly, okay? <coughs> the thing is, right, I don't need to give you all my ID. What, what? Then, then, then why should I give you the details of this place? Okay. And you are in a government... You can site. call me DJ, yeah? DJ. What is DJ? DJ is my name, my first name, DJ. So I've been polite enough to give you that. Okay, you're a gentleman. So just a minute. You're a gentleman. Yeah. I just wanted to know me. whether it's two different prisons. That's so, it. <laughs> I, I, why should we give you I'm sure it's public information. What public information is available in front public site? But I, I walk down the road and there's a prison on both sides. It's very strange. No, no, but, but why should we give this information to you? Why not? It's public information, isn't it? All right. Public information. Lots of people coming over, yeah? No, but you shouldn't do the thing which are not allowed on our Carry on, mate. I'm, don't, don't mind me, like. All right, mate.
Go on, guys. See, they don't care. They don't care. All right, guys. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you call? Did you tell? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. They already know, my friend. They're already aware. Yeah. I'm just trying to find out whether it's two different prisons. That's all I want to know, and I'll go. I'm sure it's public knowledge, but just just for the video, I wanted to know. I can't say anything. So I noticed you got a road in between the two. So that's that's all. Once I find out, I'm going to go, so. <laughs> <coughs> oh, it's been cold, isn't it, lately? You look like you're in charge, my friend. Charge? Well, you look like you're high up. Oh, you know, you're in custody, so you're a yeah, yeah. practitioner of kinds. I thought you were the boss then. Yeah, anyway, if you can give me the information about the two prisons, I'll go. J. DJ J J. I'll make videos on hotels. Hotels housing asylum seekers. So this place is is topic wise is perfect for my video. Makes sense. So I normally cover stories on hotels. You see. Talk to people, residents, see how long they've been in there, stuff like that. Um, so I came here just to do a video of the site. That's it. I walked down the road there and I noticed on both sides there's prison. So I thought I'd ask somebody, the first person I see, if it's two prisons or, or one and they're just a separate building kind of thing. You'll find all the information on the internet. And, uh, it's two prisons, you're, isn't it? If you are doing the media, <coughs> You must have done your research and you knew what, what these places are. I'll be honest, the I didn't. are written and uh, on the public domain you have a lot of information. Hey, you got a visitor. Can we help you? Uh, yeah, maybe, yeah. Maybe. If you open the door, I'll tell you. <coughs> oh dear, he got told off then, didn't he? Oh dear. David? Although his name's Jay on his ID. Strange. Long day, my friend. <laughs> Long day. <laughs> yeah. You look uh, tired, man. <laughs> you right? Good morning. Yeah. Morning yeah. Good man. Do you work here? Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm delivered. Thank you. Oh, delivery. Uh, yeah. Cool, man. He's in a waiting room. He's coming in about uh, 15 minutes. Oh, okay. Cool. Call it. Yeah. That's why I'm calling. Uh, slow. <laughs> ah, cool. Nice. Nice. Okay. Take yeah. care, mate. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so Heathrow Immigration Removal Centre, Harmonsworth and Colnbrook. Obviously, they're two different removal centres on the same site. <coughs> Suppose they have to have two because of the road in between. Makes it a little bit awkward, really. Heathrow is just behind that building over there. Have a little walk over here.
Huh? Is he looking for me? Is he that guy? <coughs> maybe, maybe not. <coughs> Apologies for the cough, everybody. I didn't know you got two prisons here. Yeah, no, yeah, it is separate. It used to be several of the median to one now. Did it? Oh, it's one now? Yeah, I was going to yeah. say, is it because of the road in between? No, I think it's just what the immigration wanted as a contract, so... Ah... Uh, because so I thought there was only one, and then I saw that, and I thought, oh, it's two. <laughs> no, it's the same Heathrow all together. Thanks, Fat. Cheers. Is he inside? Yeah, yeah. Back and forth today. Is it? <laughs> I think the high vis is uh, working on some people. The high vis makes it look like I have a reason to be here. Be it delivery driver or visitor, the high vis is paying off. <coughs> the visitor centre there. We're not going to film into the prison because we know they don't like that. Gate opening, who's coming out? Oh, just a person, people. Three people. Hello. Have you released? Yes. Oh, well done. How long have you been there for? 20 days. 20 days? How long were you inside? Uh, 15. 15 days. Oh, no, sorry, no light. No lighter. Is it nice inside or is it, is it bad? Yeah, it's good. It's okay? So you guys are free now? You free or you have to go back? Free. I just no wait more. for no taxi to no come. More. No more. No more. So you're staying in this? Fast and last. So you're staying here now? Yes. Yeah. Cool man. Cool. Which uh, which country are you all from? Where, where are you from? Uh, Burma. Burma. Yeah. Uh, Burma. And you? Uh, Albania. Albania. Nice. You? Polish. 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 Ah, oh, nice one. You cool. Put, you put in YouTube. <laughs> yeah, doing a video on the prison today. Yeah, yeah speaking to the officers and stuff. Inside, what's it like inside? Yes, what? Is waiting room here? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just waiting for. Oh, rail. Rail warrants. Where are you going to? Let's have a look. Well, I'm Heathrow to. Oh, what? Okay. So you know where you're going, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, so this side, yeah? yeah I think so. Yeah. yeah. Take care, guys. Thank you. Well, three people being released. It's visitor centre. If you need information, yeah, check in there. How many hours a day they let you out the cell? Wait, is my daughter coming? The daughter? Yeah, my daughter. Car park. Uh, here. <coughs> or maybe here. Maybe up there. <coughs> Parking up there. Every day, they open the door? No. Lock? Lock, yeah. Sorted, yeah? yeah. Cool, man. Yeah. Take care. Any tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was good timing, getting, getting a few releases coming out. So they got a free rail warrant, rail card to get home, basically. Undercover police. 72 plate. <coughs> got another one coming out here. Mark car. You've been waiting ages. Tedious job, yeah? Good job. Is it? Yeah. Pay good. Lots of waiting around though, right? Nothing. Not too bad. Cool. Well, I think we've got some uh, decent information here today. It's been fairly informative. We've had a fair few interactions, which is good. 
This guy's still waiting to go in. I spoke to him in the van when I arrived. Got a painter there, two painters. It's all right. You all right? <laughs> Well, we're going to be done here very, very soon. We're going to go. No need to be here longer than necessary. I think uh, the powers that be here, they've, they've sent the signal to not engage. They've probably had a lot of people come here before. I imagine a lot of auditors have been here. So more than likely, they're going to leave me be more or less. I think we've got some more undercover police coming out. Yeah, more undercovers coming out. In their new Volvo, 71 plate. All right, I think we're going to be done. Heathrow Immigration Removal Centre. <coughs> and next door, we've got a court and tribunal centre. So let's just very quickly show the camera that, and then we'll go. Quite lucky to see three people coming out, though. Usually they release people in the morning, nine, ten o'clock at these sorts of places. What happened to that bike shed there? Oh dear. Oh dear. Not good at all that. Crown Property, HM Courts and Tribunal Service, Harmonsworth. Now we're not going to be able to film inside here. I'll have a quick look at, through the door. Oh, it's locked. Locked. It's closed? Is it closed? The court. Finish. Oh. The door is locked. It's finished here. I don't know. Oh right. We don't work here. Oh, you look uh, like you like you work here. <laughs> no. You dress <laughs> professionally. The, where is the reception? The centre. Yeah. What for the court or for the immigration? No, for the detention centre. Are you picking somebody up? No, I'm going to see somebody. Oh yeah, the visitor centre's there. So from here. Just there, look that 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 little building with the green windows. Okay. okay. All right. No worries. All right. Oh, no, you look like professionally dressed, so... Well, I'm professional. <laughs> I'm a solicitor. <laughs> oh, are you? Yes. Criminal? No, immigration. Immigration? Yeah. Ah, nice. Very good. Ah, so you're doing a legal visit? Yes. Ah, now it makes sense. Good. to get the person out. That's good. You are trying to keep him in. <laughs> I'm not trying to keep him in. Okay. No, no, I don't work for the prison. Oh, okay, you don't work. I'm an independent journalist. Oh, you are a journalist. I'm doing a story on the prison. Good. Yeah, so I'm on your side. <laughs> I'm not so sure. Not on uh, uh, Suela's side. She's uh, saying everybody should be thrown out. <laughs> yeah, no, it depends. Well, that's what she Everybody should do. Uh, she says even the, uh, the, the protest marches are uh, hateful things. No, I think everybody should be entitled to their rights, right? And you're protecting their rights, so you're doing a good job, my friend. Have a good visit, all right? All right, no worries. <coughs> Happy to be out? Freedom, yeah? 
<laughs> very good, very good. Are you looking forward to eating some nice food? Please, yes. Please, this call this my daughter. Please, this. You have the phone number. Yes. Yeah, you yeah. have the number. Zero seven. One second, yeah. Thank let you. Me, let me let, let me turn the camera. Maybe she's driving. One second. One more, yeah. One yeah, more. yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Got it, yeah. Yeah. No worries. Thank you. All right. You look very happy. So you're just going to have to explain just one thing. Um, are you? You're, you currently are on town site. Um, we don't have a problem with you filming providing you outside the centre, which is just out there on the main road. So anything over there is fine. Over here is just not permitted because we understand you've been filming the staff and everything and without their permission, which is not authorised. We have don't need contacted the police. They I spoke to the police already. Oh, fine. weird. They actually are on their way, so we just wanted to let you know that please, if you don't mind, just make your way to the front of the building, but please don't access these areas. This is actually government crown site. One thing, right? That's a public road going through. That, that over there is, yes, but you're, this is not. Yeah, no, I understand that. Um, just one thing to say, I, I haven't been directly filming staff on purpose, but obviously you've spoke to me, so I'm filming you, but I'm not, yeah, I haven't come over to you. Ask me if you can film me. That's clearly got a camera on, you've clearly got a camera on. You Never, you never gave me that permission, you never asked yeah. me. So that's, that's all I'm saying. I don't wish to cause any issues. No, no, no. I'm just being. We have to work fair. But I, I'm just trying to explain to you what yeah. the situation is. Like your colleague know, spoke to me. Yeah. Got a body come on. Yeah. I didn't have to be recorded, but she's recording. Yeah, but you that's the way it is. Anyway, look, so listen, all I'm saying. But you don't want to hear it when it's the way around, do you? I have contacted the police. They are actually aware of what's going on. Yeah. And so what I'm doing is not illegal. So you shouldn't really involve the police. It's it's okay. This part of the building. Yeah. This part. Anything from that road there. So if you're saying that this is private property, yes, it is. and you're rescinding my my public right of way to be here, that's fine. Tell me where you want me to stand, and I'll go there. But you don't need to ring the police. You need to just ask me to do that. And I'll go and do that. That's fine. Okay, just out there on the main road. Just, just, so just pretty much that road there. that goes through the centre is public not, as not well. The, not the road through the centre, no. Who owns that road? Um, that's owned by the Crown site as well. I'm not sure about that, you know. Really, because I walked down there, and it looks like it's maintained by the council. It, I haven't checked, but. <laughs> anyway, look. Let's be honest, right? I've I've pretty much finished my video today. Okay. So I don't need to be here longer than necessary. Okay. But if the police are coming. Then I might I might as well wait around for them Which to just are, to speak to are, them. They are on their way, but yeah, just just over there is fine. But please. Well, why have they please, called the police? Can I just ask why? It, it, because it's crown site, and if you're. What do you expect the police to do? People, yeah. Like staff inside, right. And they've asked not to be filmed. They didn't say that. But, I, haven't, I haven't been asked not know, to film it, anybody. It's not appropriate, really. So that that's what they they're saying is that it's not appropriate. They don't wish to be filmed. So that, that's all I'm It's not I'm a police asking, matter, though. Sir. That's all I'm asking, yeah. is that you... You've... <coughs> I'm not being awkward with you. I'm just asking the question. Yeah. The police don't really need to be involved. Well, Had might... somebody politely asked me what you've asked me now and say, look, you can be here, but not there, I'd have done that. Yeah. But nobody did. They just said, don't record, which I'm allowed to record by law. Mm. But obviously, civilly, civil law, yeah. trespassing is a matter. Yeah. So you asked me to leave and I've... Well, I'm going to pretty much be out now. Yeah. Police are wasting their time, isn't it? Thank you. No, I understand that, but they are actually on their way. Shall I? Is it an emergency? Did you ring them on a 999 call? Right. Okay, I'll hang around a little bit for them. It, yeah, ju just over there is fine, but please, none of the vehicles, none of nobody's vehicles, no oh, one's oh, I've already been over there. Yeah. Everything's caught already. I'm aware. I'm aware. <laughs> anyway, have a nice day, ladies. Thank All right? You. Thanks. Well, guys, we're going to go over here. Um, we're finished anyway here. So we're going to go over to this path over here. If the police are on their way, we may as well wait for them. <coughs> uh, and I'm wondering which, where the public road finishes. But double yellows on here. Double yellows go down part of that road over there. 
So where the double yellow's finished, that may well be where the Crown property begins for that, that mini road. But it's a shared road anyway. There are two other gates down there. But uh, I'm not here to prove any points. I've got my video, I'm happy. I'm going to hang around a little bit for the police, see what happens. If they don't come in five minutes, we're going to go. You wait for a taxi? Are you waiting for a taxi? Oh. Well guys, there we go, immigration centre finished. We're not going to wait for the police. Got other places to go. So, this weird guy following me behind, there, looking very shifty on the corner, and then decides to follow me. Let's see how far he follows me. Public footpath there. Oh well, camera's still rolling, so we're going to pull into this hotel here, uh, see where he goes. No sign of the police anyway. Sheraton Hotel. This hotel was actually down on the list for asylum seeker. But upon calling them, they said they're open. So, never came here. It looks a very nice hotel. We're going to go inside anyway and inquire. Why not? Nothing to lose. Could be a 50-50 contract here. <coughs> there we go, straight across. Yeah, maybe he wasn't following me, but strange guy. Very strange guy. You stay here? Are you staying here? Sorry? Who am I? What do you mean, who am I? You filming me, yeah? Why? Are you security? No. Oh, why you me? What it is, I make videos yeah. on hotels yeah. that have an uh, asylum seeker contract. Oh, so, do, do they have an asylum seeker here? I don't think so. So, you're a normal paying guest? Yeah, so you know the police over there? Yes. The, one I saw you before. the immigration centre? Yeah, so over there, so, yeah, it said no public access. What does that mean? It said what, sorry? No public access? Yeah, what does it mean? It means... Yeah. Well, hold on, where are we talking about? Just, just down there, when I first uh, saw you. When I came out? Yeah, when you came out over there, yeah. Uh, I don't know what that means, you tell me. Right. Yeah, well, it, what it means is, if you have a reason to be in there, you can go in there. Uh, so you have a reason to be there? Yeah, I was making a video on it. So did it say nothing to you? Say again? Did it, did it say nothing to you? Uh, they did. 
Yeah. Yeah. Do you have permission? No. Oh, so they always keep permission in there. They, they came out, they told me not to record, yeah. but I carried on recording, I didn't and I've gone. Oh, they just told you to Yeah, because it, yeah. Uh, as long as you don't go inside the building, it's okay. Yeah, but even if you stand here, someone can come, come up to you and be like, this place is private, you have to leave. Yeah, That's well, yeah. Yeah, of course I can. Yeah, because they'd be like, well, the main road is public. <coughs> the thing is, if you're going to go to visit somebody, you can go in there, right? Yeah, if you want to. So. Yeah, but then you have a genuine reason. You have a right away to go in there. Well, like, if you're filming, that could be possibly, because that might be your job. So, like, they don't know that. The thing is, they get very confrontational. They come up to you. So, why, what are you doing? Uh, I'm doing it for social media. You're doing it for social media? Yeah. I wonder what you were doing, because you were standing on the corner. I wasn't too sure and then you walked away, and then now you're here. Yeah, because I wasn't too sure if I should go there, because the sign said uh, no problem. Yeah, so what it is... Yeah. I don't want to get arrested you, you, for... Uh, no, you can't, it's trespassing. Yeah, but if it's trespassing, designated sign, you can't get arrested. <coughs> it's a trespassing civil matter. Yeah, but designated sign, you can't get arrested. So let's say if you trespass in the back of a police station, you can't get arrested. If you're inside, if you've gone over a fence... Yeah, yeah. Not, not, not if you're in the car park. There's an air sign, it's usually um, like, for example, Buckingham Palace. Yeah, that's different. Places like that. Not there. <coughs> that's a prison, right? Basically, it's a prison. It's a prison there? It's a prison, yeah. Is it, is it HOP? No, it's uh, Immigration Removal Centre. How is it a prison? It's a prison. So people that have immigration problem at the airport, yeah. they hold them there until they're sorted out. Oh, so they have like a custody suite? Yeah. It's, just, oh. it's exactly the same as the prison rules. Oh. So you can walk in the car park and film. If the police come, yeah. they can't really do anything about it. They'll just say for you to leave. Yeah, that's it. If you don't leave... Because I feel people without the permission. People, I don't know where that's come from, but people think you need permission to film. I know, that's what they you told me there. That, you don't need that, do you? No. If I don't tell people, they'll be like, delete it. If you film... Hold on. If you film somebody in public or on private property, it doesn't really matter. You don't need permission. But like, here's private property. Yeah, so if, if you work for the hotel and I'm filming you, yeah. it doesn't really matter, it's not against the law. It's not exactly, people are like, delete it. If you're filming you without my permission, it's illegal, delete it. Yeah, yeah, so... But you know, the police can't, because they can't take your phone from you. They actually need a court order for that. Yeah, the police can't take your phone off you. They need the police order. can't they, check the footage, nothing like that. People don't know that, you see, they come up to you and they'll be like, oh, you have to leave. Yeah. Or otherwise, um, if you, you don't, actually not delete it first, then you can leave. Yeah. Yeah. You just need to know, you just need to know where you stand. Yeah. I mean, it's happened to me before. I was over at Pizza Hut. Yeah. And there was two girls in there, no Oxbridge, you know that place? I know Oxbridge, I don't know yeah. pizza shop. I was up there in the pizza shop and they were inside and they saw me filming. And I got them on video. And I admitted it and they were like, delete it, I'm not going to delete it. And they called the police. So they locked me in there, they called the police. <laughs> really? Now seriously, they locked me in there, they called the police, about three, four units, about ten police officers. and all That's crazy, mate. Nothing. <coughs> So you asked me to move here? Yeah, because you can record yeah. anything in public. If, if, if they feel you're doing... If, yeah, because if, I, was, I was not in public, I was in the pizza shop, and they were like, you have to leave that private property. And I said, fine, I'll... That doesn't matter, but if they feel you're yeah. filming for a crime, a criminal reason, yeah. like filming... Uh, if you film a police station, that's terrorism, isn't it? No, no, it's not. Yeah, it is. I mean, I've been detained for terrorism doing that. Yeah, so you can sue the police for that. Yeah, you can. Yeah. For what? They for can't what? detain you for the terrorist act. Uh, through can, only just filming a police station. Do they usually do? Are you filming the back of a police station? You go on YouTube, you'll see all the auditors that do that. Yeah, like DJ. They see the police. You know Audit in Britain? I know Audit in Britain, yeah. Yeah, so he does the same thing. Yeah. And they, they, they're just it's pointless, isn't it? Like, if they detain you for the terrorist act, you need to sue the police. If they because if you're just filming and nothing else, then that's not grounds. But if you want to go back in there and film, go and film, man. Yeah, I might go there. If they tell you to leave, you just say, look, I'm here to do a video. I respect what you've said, but I'm going to continue my video. Yeah, I'm going to continue my video. That's what I said. <coughs> she said, oh, I want you to stop filming and stuff. I said, I'm going to be here filming. I've came you're to do a video. You're doing for a job, aren't you? No, yeah. YouTube, YouTube. You're doing it for YouTube? Yeah. Oh. You're doing it for YouTube. So what's your channel for? DJ Media. DJ Media. I know DJ Audits. I know DJ. Oh, you know that guy? Yeah. yeah I know DJ Audits. I've got two channels. I've got DJ Pinnock. DJ Pinnock is like o DJ Audits. He, I do like uh, companies and stuff. So you're an auditor? Yeah. And then DJ Media. I do like uh, asylum seeker hotels and I do uh, prison stuff like that. You don't, you don't do hotels, you don't do anything else. Do you do police stations? I used to do police stations, but everybody's doing police stations, so I stopped doing it. Yeah, just too much, yeah. Because the police, the police are used to it, so a lot of the police don't react. Yeah, Am I going to be on YouTube? <laughs> you will be, yeah. Yeah, because I was saying on the camera, I said there's a strange guy standing on the corner, yeah. and now he's following me. 
Because you thought you would follow it up there, yeah? Yeah, I don't know who you were. I've so seen you stood there, so when I came out, I turned the camera on. I was going to say, the guys follow me to the hotel. <laughs> but no, that's cool, that's cool. I see when I came out. No, that's cool. That's fine. That's cool. Go back in there and record, man. Yeah, I might as well. Yeah, they said they called the police, so the police might turn up now. Be good for your video. Yeah, I'm on back in. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to drive past. If I see the police, I'll come back. Take care, man.